Hello Feathers! I am Katie Denowden from katiedenowden.com and I am pumped to share with you guys some of my hard-earned wisdom and tips to set you up to not just fully give and grow your biz in 2015, but to truly live and love and celebrate your life along the way. Because sometimes, just sometimes, that gets put in the back burner when we're growing our businesses. But maybe that's just me. So think of this as freedom and contagious joy with a pinch of strategy. Right, Amber? So one of my favorite phrases working with entrepreneurs and just smart, driven women in general is women who are alive, not perfect, change the world. So when I first started my business in 2011, I felt I needed the right email provider, the perfect copy for my websites and my newsletters and social media. I needed more social media likes, incredibly high quality videos, and I was striving to be like some ideal I created in my mind. And my personal life was blah. I was working so much, I was burning the candle at both ends, and I just thought, when I finally get to blank, in my business then, then I'll decorate my bedroom the way I want, and then I'll go on vacation and have those romantic date nights. But if I then, ladies, it freaking sucked. <laughs> and it came to a point where I was like, what the hell? What am I doing? And basically I just said, screw it. I wanted to experience my life. I wanted freedom and joy and abundance. And I didn't know it at the time, but I wanted to feel my life while I was in it not just create memories or have achievements to talk about. And what happened when I stepped into that and I allowed that to lead my planning? Well, when I started to truly live first, I tripled my revenue, I quadrupled my list in six weeks, and I got more invitations to be a guest expert and speaker than I had in all of the past years combined. <laughs> Why? Well, because I stopped being boring and just existing. I started to design my life and truly live it. And the key is experience your life so that others can experience you or your brand. And it is one of the most magnetic and easy and fun ways to grow your business. And it provides true connection and authenticity without ever trying. And it can make you the most magnetic and interesting person at a party or a networking event, hands down. So as you're planning things out real quick, what does it mean to truly experience our lives and live? It means to have a direct experience with this present moment. So how do we tap into that? Your senses, your taste, touch, smell, sound, and even the emotions and how you feel. They are the perfect gateway to the present moment and having a direct experience with our lives. The texture of creme brulee, the sound of cracking the top of it, you know, the feel of sad on our skin, oh my gosh, the smell of hot cocoa or even puppy breath. <laughs> we remember our lives through experiences in our senses, not facts or thoughts for the most part. And it instantly connects us to this present moment and awakens every fiber of our being if we pay attention to it. And this ignites your life and your business. So we're keeping this uber simple. In 2015, and I challenged you before, then with the holidays coming, is what do you need to experience so that others can experience you? And it can be baking, it can be macaroon tasting, it can be dabbling with essential oils, bubble baths, art museums, trapeze training, <laughs> traveling to your favorite town 30 minutes away, or the perfect latte. So write down exactly what you want to see, taste, touch, smell, and feel in your life. Then create what I call a soul food box. So that chocolate bar, that travel book about Paris, your favorite magazine, your playlist, certificate for a massage, date night idea jar. Put all of those things in a place so you will plan, go to them when you need to, and start using them to truly live your life. And then tell other people that you trust and make social accountability. Make it a non-negotiable in your life. And promise me, when you're stuck and burnt out, make a commitment right now to have an experience be your tool of choice instead of numbing out, instead of comparing, instead of avoiding and getting backed up. 
Set yourself up now for what I call inevitable success and freedom by tapping into your life. Feel your life while you're in it. And if not, everyone else can tell and your business will respond accordingly. And every day, allow ordinary moments to become extraordinary by tapping into your senses and truly living your life. Amber, thank you for letting me join in on this. Ladies, you are freaking awesome. I can't wait to hear and see what comes from this plan of fun event. And have a fabulous weekend. Take care.